Okay, this is a sample of a chartered certified accountant exam exam question, right? So it's a quite quite a short question, quite a short question. But well, how how to solve this question? It reads here a company. Okay, so when um if if later on if you sign up for my class, right? Before the class, I would uh, have a pre orientation first um to to make sure that you have ready whatever necessary before you start the class like for example here i would like everyone to have all the materials the hard copy of it ready because the thing is you can see now how difficult it is um, if you don't have the hard copy of the materials laid ready how am i go going to you know if you don't have the hard copy of the so that so now i'm showing you the screen then um after that, how am I going to show you another screen uh, of how to do it and when you don't have a hard copy of this? So that's, that's why you have, you must have the hard copy of the question with you, you know, um, before the, the real uh, lessons, which I will orientate you, uh, you know, I will get ready you before the, the lessons. Okay, so this one, quite a short question, quite a short question and then multiple choice. So which is the answer? Right, a company which operates a process costing system had work in progress at the start of last month. Last month, okay. For example, this month is uh, December twenty twenty, so last month would be November twenty twenty. So last, so that means at the beginning of uh, for example, December twenty twenty, they have three hundred units value at one seven one zero, which was sixty percent complete with respect to all costs. Last month, a total. Of 2,000 units were completed and transferred to finished goods warehouse. The cost per equivalent unit, right, for cost arising last month, for example, uh, you know, like what I said last month, for example, is December 2020, was $10. The company uses FIFO stands for first in, first out method of cost allocation. What was the total value of the 2,000 unit? So that means like what we understand here, December, they completed a total unit of 2,000 unit transferred to where, uh, finished goods warehouse last month. So who already has the answer? But is your answer correct? Right? Some people say, oh, $10. Then one, uh, there are 2,000 unit. 2,000 times 10 is 20,000. Very easy. No, that is not the correct answer. That is not the correct answer. That is not the the correct answer. So, so what is what is the what is the co correct answer? So, what is the correct answer, right? Okay. So, how to answer the question? How to answer the question? Okay, a company. So that means you are saying that we are saying that at the beginning, right? At the beginning. Right, uh, we have three hundred units, probably, for example, three hundred um can of biscuits, right? Three hundred units of uh biscuits, and they were three hundred units, and this three hundred units is sixty percent complete, sixty percent complete. So if you take three hundred times sixty percent, that means it is equivalent to hundred and eighty units of fully completed for example cans of biscuits right so this is at the beginning of um well let's say beginning of for example beginning of december 2020 so that means this 180 units was was manufactured was manufactured right when was this manufactured so that means this was probably manufactured in the previous month manufactured in uh, November 2020, right? Okay, so that means, okay, so that means at the beginning of the month, we have uh, 180 equivalent units, equivalent units. At the end of December, end of the month, right, we have 2,000 units. At the end of the month, we have 2,000 units. 2,000 units. So that means during the month, uh, for example, of December, how many units that we have um we have was manufactured in how many equivalent units, equivalent completed units that we manufactured in 
December. So if you take 2000 minus 180, so I know in December, we make 1820 equivalent uh, full unit, equivalent completed units, right? Equivalent completed units, right? And we know that, I mean, during last month, like last month, for example, is December 2020, right? December 2020 um, is $10 per unit. $10 per unit. So $10 per unit times one, uh, 1820 would be 18200. 18200. Then last month, last month is 180 units. 180 units is how much? The cost is 1720. 1720. So can you add up 182 uh 182 zero plus 17 no sorry 1710 I saw wrong here. 1710. Once okay, 1, so the answer is the third one, right? Okay, so if you find this um, Chartered Certified Accountant questions challenging, uh, do follow our page, do follow our page and also our YouTube chan channel and also do uh, look at our website because there is no minimum age or qualification requirement to start this Chartered Certified Accountant exam and if you only pass the first three papers, you know, some of the questions um, are, are what I see. This is quite a difficult question, right? Uh, if you pass, passing mark is 50%. If you pass the first three papers, you will get a diploma in accounting and business, right? Diploma in Accounting and Business, which will enable you to get uh, very good jobs. And if you pass all the 13 papers, right, plus um, in total, three years relevant working experiences, you will become a Chartered Certified Accountant. Okay, so I uh, hope you will be interested. Okay, bye. See you. So uh, look up at our page. Right.